Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Stardew Valley. So let's just get started and take a quick look at the TV, see what's on. Uh, clear and sunny tomorrow, perfect weather for the Luau. The event will take place on the beach starting between 9 and 2 p.m. Don't be late. Ooh, that sounds quite, quite a lot of fun actually. Right, fortune teller. Uh, today the spirits are very happy. They will do their best to shower everyone with good fortune. I think we should go to the mines today, definitely. And finally, we got the rerun on the Queen of Sauce, baked fish. You already know how to cook baked fish. Right. Let's get outside and see what we got. We've got uh, that one I'm going to have to use a scythe to be able to harvest. I've got some beans there to harvest. Nothing else to harvest at the moment. We've got all kinds of things. We've got our... Remember, we did all this work here in our property uh, in the last episode. So I'm just going to come down here and refill that one a minute. There we go. And we'll grab... Well, let's just check the mail first. Uh, Dear Frithgar, tomorrow we're all gathering on the beach for the annual Pelican Town Luau. The highlight of the event is the communal potluck. Make sure you bring something good to contribute. The governor himself is attending the event, so make sure you're on your best behavior. Come to the beach between 9 and 2. Mayor Lewis. Okay, what are we going to contribute? I have no idea. I've, I've, I've not had time to prepare anything. I didn't even know that I was supposed to prepare anything. Right, let's put those in there. And we come down here. Let's take a look in our box. I'm considering giving the Jamborite. That seems like a, a nice thing to give. Um, I mean, I've got some iron ore there and amethyst. I mean, amethyst... I guess that amethyst I'd be more likely to find again. Uh, the geode, I could take the black. I'm going to actually hold on to the geode. And we'll get some more geodes at a later date. Um, let me just get rid of those. And sunflower, I'm going to keep for a minute. Uh, in here. Yeah, I'll put some flour in there. So I've got some wheat there already. So let's go and get this piece of wheat and we'll also get... There we go. Take that one. So I've got one wheat and I want to get that one as well. There we go. Right, that's everything that I can get at the moment. Smooth the cat. And... Right, I'll just quickly water everything and then I think we will just go to the mines today. Because we've got, because luck is like uh, really quite important, and we have apparently got a lot of good luck today. So I'm, I'm quite sort of, thi I'm thinking it would be a really good idea if we do go to the mines today. All right, I'm going to dump in the watering can and a copper bars, and I'm going to keep the coal on me for a minute. We've got crab pots there. Uh, I need to put them in water, don't I? I'm not going to worry about those either today. I'm going to get rid, put those up. I'm going to put that one up and that one. Uh, the hoe, actually the axe can go, and I'll keep those three there. And then I'm going to go into this chest, and I'm going to put those two up as well. So I've got everything out. Oh, I do I do want to take some food, don't I? So let me get some, we'll get some green algae and uh, the field snacks. Uh, there's probably enough, actually. I'm going to take two of those, two of those as well. And I'm going to make some more field snacks, because I think those are actually going to help us a bit. So if I grab a couple of those there like that, we've got some energy. The energy is sort of doing all right at the moment, but uh, we, we can get more energy as we go along. There's a thingy up there that we could forage. I'm not going to worry about that. I want to get to the mines as quickly as possible, and we'll see if we can get down a few levels, and then maybe get like a little bit more um, coal and... Well, not just coal, is it? It's... Uh, no, I, uh, iron ore. Iron is the one that I want. Uh, we, well, I mean, we've got loads of copper at the moment, but it'd be nice to get some more copper. But uh, if the further down we get, the more likely we are to get to the iron. And I think that was like level uh, 50 or 60 or something. It's, it's quite a long way down that we got to go anyway. Right. Let's hit the lift. There we go. Down to level 35. So we are, we're doing fairly well. And let's get started. So what I want to do, I want to find my way down as low as I can. Uh, I should have brought a torch with me, shouldn't I? I don't have any timber, and I, yeah, because I think if you carry a torch, it does at least light it up a little bit. And it is starting to get quite dark around here. Ooh, let's take that one. And then I can get the, ooh, no, the bat's not dead. It's not a bat, it's a golem thingy. I found out that they were called golems. I got quite worried about these last time. They, they did really start to get me scared. Um, but it turned out it was all right. It wasn't all bad. Uh, there's... Oh, that's a harder stone there. Uh, why can't I get through? 
I, I, I want to get out. I, oh, there we go. I can go down through that one. Right, let's not worry about any more of those. Uh, now, this oh, there's a nasty thing there. Sword, 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 sword. Go on. Where is he? Oh, he's, he's right underneath me. There we go. Took him out. And... Oh, right, I think it's copper that I can see. I'm wondering what this stuff is glowing in the dark. But it's actually copper by the, by the look of it. So we'll grab that. I am hoping that it does get lighter again. I really don't like this whole dull thing that's going on here. It's it's not appealing to me in any way. It's um it's it's making me quite nervous. So let's get that one there and oh right. See now I I want to get the the copper that's down here. Come on, bat. Come here. Right. It's got the bat and go to this one so that I can get the copper and that one more copper. I don't think there's anything... No, I'm not going to go any further down there. We've got the exit, so we can go straight down to the next level. And here, we've got some actual stuff that we can um, harvest. So we might be able to get some sap from here. And I think if you hold a torch... And I don't know this for certain, but I've, I think if you hold a torch, it does actually help you. Right, we can get down through there. I'm just going to come over this way, because there's a. Ch I see I spidered a chest over there. So I will come over to the chest. And there's some more stuff over there. Uh, let's go over this way. I can go around that. I can pick that one up. And I can mine that copper. There's another chest over there. Okay, we've got a lot of stuff here. This is excellent. I'm going to go through these two here like this. There we go. What did I get? Omni Geode. I have no idea what an Omni Geode is. Uh, but I'm assuming it's a good thing. Because any geodes, I think, are good things to have. So let's eat another one of those. 13 energy and 5 health. I've used up quite a lot of energy. Now these here, they give 45 energy and 18 health. So if I eat one of those... That's boosted my energy a bit. That's more like it. Right. Let's chop that one open. We didn't get anything from there. Uh, was there something down this way? No, there wasn't. There's that chest there, and then we want to go. So I want to come down around underneath there and swipe that chest. Nothing in there. Uh, I don't think there's anything there. No. Right, let's go. Next level. Level 38. Right, we've got some copper there. Oh, there's some coal here. So you use that one and it gives you coal in the, um, off of the barrow thing. Uh, there's a bat coming somewhere. Where's that bat? I can hear the bat, but I see it not. Where are you, bat? Oh, there it is. There's a chest there as well. Or have I got that wrong? Oh, I thought there was a chest there. There's a bat there. I see him. In the darkness. Right, let's go and get these bits of copper here. So I got one there. And then I got one more down here. Take that one out. Right, that's pretty much it for this level. So let's see if we can just find the stairs. And then we can head on down to level 39. I got another Omni Geode. I don't know what these Omni Geodes are, but I'm assuming that they're good things. Grab that one, and there. Nope, still nothing. I'm going to eat another field snack. I don't want to risk running out of any energy here. Uh, let's come to there. And uh, nope. Right, see, now in the dark, I've got a job to see. Oh, I was already, it was already open. I've wasted all of that um, energy with the pickaxe. That's what I don't like about the darkness. Now, somebody did say that there is actually a ring that I can get that will help me. And I'll be able to find my way down to the next levels using... Well, because there's some light that's available with this ring. Are they, can I get these torches? i got torches here. I can see torches. Can I pick them up off the ground? That would be a very, very cool thing. If, I can! I can pick them up! All this time, I never knew. Right, let's get that one there. And then... <gasps> I just carry the torch! Oh, it's so beautiful. Light! Light, it's so wonderful. Let's grab that one, and if I go like that, I can see. <laughs> oh, this is amazing. Let's grab that, and there we go. We've got a load of copper here. This is more like it. Let's grab that bit, and then down here. Right, I've got a bat on his way, coming to see me. Have a little chat. That's all right, batty. There, and nope, I'm going to go like that. There we go. Right, I don't see anything else down this side, so let's head back up here. Uh, nothing here. 
Right, let's go down through this one. And I've reached another level. We've got a chest here as well. This is snowy. Snowy caverns. Right. Uh, level 40 now. So let's open this chest. What do we got? We've got a slingshot. Ooh. You received a slingshot. Right. Let me go into here. So I'm assuming that you... Uh, common material with many... Oh. Um, yeah, I want to move... Let me... I'm going to put it next to my weapon. I see... No. How do I do this? I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to do the stone down there like that. Right. So this one... Ah. Out of ammo. Uh, how do I make ammo? Can I can I craft ammo for it? I'd have nothing. Oh, I can scroll down. Uh, campfire. No. Uh, well, how how do I make ammunition for it? This is not good. Maybe I can. Can I use that? No. Requires stones for ammo. I have stone. Stones right there. Um. Is there a special way that I do this? Let me let me just... I'm going to see if I can just play around with this for a minute and see if I can figure something out. Okay, I have got no idea. There doesn't seem to be any way to do it. It's 8 p.m. I don't know if we can get down another four levels or not, but we've got lots of cold stuff here now. Seems to be the cold zone. So I'm wondering if I've actually reached the level of iron, because that looks like iron there. Uh, i got things trying to hurt me. Right, there's another kill. And these little frosty things. I don't know what these are. Uh, but that looks like iron ore. I think we have found the iron ore. Ladies and gentlemen, it was level 40. I thought it was level 50. Nope, it's level 40. So we can now have iron ore, which means that we can start making iron bars. What's this? Uh, I don't know what that was, but I'm assuming it was something that I might have needed. Oh, maybe not. There's lots more of them here. Let me do that. Right. Oh, they give some coal. I can break those glass things. I go round here, maybe. There we go. Kill him. And I'm just going to keep breaking these glass things, because I, I really don't know what they are. And I'll go to that one. Right, it's 9.30. This is where it starts to get a bit suspect about whether or not I can get down to another level. Although, to be honest, I'm not that bothered about it. What I really like to do is upgrade a few things now. I've got, I've reached the iron ore levels, and I've got some iron ore, so I'm just going to get through here, go to my sword, and I kill these guys here, these little things. They kill pretty easily, actually. There's just lots of them. Right, so I've got that one. I've got a bit more coal there, and then I've got some more iron ore on this one. It's 10.20 p.m., so I don't really want to hang around and do very much more. I think we'll go one... Can we go... Yeah, we'll, we'll go one more level. One more, and then we'll we'll call it a day. Uh, so I want to go there. There we go. Careful. Careful that he doesn't hurt me too much. So I want to know what these glass things are. What, what am I breaking here? Is there something special to do with them? And get through there. I've got another slime there. And, oh, there's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of chests and stuff there. So I'm quite glad I did come down one more level. Let's see what we got. I did pick something up just now. I don't know what it was, though. Uh, let's just take a look. I've got, well, I've got some wood and some stone. i got omni-geodes. i got quite a lot of good stuff, actually. We're not going down any further. I'm just going to pick this bit up here and that one. And then I'm going to get this slime get that one out the way there like that and I've got a geode there and I've got this um, box that I can pick up or um, chest whatever you want to call it barrel it's a barrel that one is um, yeah these glass things I don't know if I should be doing anything with these or not 12 a oh dear I was I, I got carried away and I lost track of the time already right 12 can I get back home in two hours I've got uh, iron there that I'm gonna grab I got a bat on his way. I don't care about the bat. I'm going to go like that. Leave the mine. Right. 1220. Oh dear. I may have cut this a little bit fine <laughs> because I did I really didn't realize what the time. I kind of got just a little bit distracted with the barrels and stuff and then that was it. It's kind of all over then, wasn't it? Um I think we can actually I think we can do it. I actually think we're going to be okay with this. We're going to get across here and somebody suggested to me at the end of the last video 
uh, th that they seen, we've got a quest that we've got to do, and I'm pretty sure I know where it is. Well, they said that they know where it is. They pointed out that the trousers that we're looking for are actually in um, the children's play park. So we may be able to find them there. So we'll go and have a look in a minute. Let's just jump into bed, and yes, we want to sleep tonight. Right. Safe. Level 3 mining, plus 1 pickaxe, proficiency, new cooking recipe, a miner's treat. I wonder what we got to do to get that one. Right. Wakey, wakey, rise and shine. We didn't actually do anything in there, um, in the mine. Uh, we, did, we didn't actually sell anything. We've got 16 iron ore. That's excellent. I don't know how to make ammo yet. we got an omni geode. We've got another earth crystal. Um, there's not actually a huge amount that I want to do today. We'll take a look at the weather forecast. Beautiful and sunny day tomorrow. Uh, fortune teller. Uh, spirits are somewhat annoyed today. And living off the land. Start tomorrow, an unusual amount of shells and corals are expected to wash up on beaches all around the world. I'm no scientist, but I've heard it's something to do with the crab mating season. At any rate, you could make some good point combing your local beach. Right, we'll do that. Before we do that, though, we're going to head down here. Now, is there anything that I can harvest today? There is nothing I can harvest. We've got a lot of butterflies everywhere, but I don't think I can do anything with those. Um, I will, though, just put, uh, swap those round. I will go and... Put the iron in there. Five iron in there. And then I'm going to come down here and I am going to get that one. And I'm going to put that away. And the bats and those and that and that and those. Um, I'll keep hold of the copper ore for a minute. The quartz can go. And I've got... Where's, oh, there's the geode. But we, we got bad luck today. So I don't really want to do anything with it. Um, right, I think that's probably a pretty good sorting out there for now. Come down here and I want to go here and I want to put that one up there like that. I need the hoe. I'm going to do it like that. There. Right. I don't know why I'm keeping the field snacks. We're not going to need those. Not today. Uh, I don't want to be watering the chests either. <laughs> uh, we'll put that back up there. Right. If I do the watering a minute and then we can go and we've got to go to the beach thing which will be starting very, very soon. The watering is done. We'll put the watering can back and we can head off to the luau at the beach. Uh, I don't want to put them in there. I actually want to put them in this one. Well, the watering can. And I'll also just grab this iron. Oh, we've got to give something. We, we're supposed to take something with us, aren't we? Uh, so let me just put that in there. The luau at the beach has already begun. So I'm going to take, I'm going to risk and take the amethyst. Actually, do I want to take the amethyst? Uh, I'm going to take a Jamborite. I have no idea if this is going to be wanted or not, but we'll soon find out. So let's go. We need to race as fast as our little legs can carry us to the beach. I've still got to come back and grab that one over there. I'm not going to worry about that right now. And we have arrived at the Luau. Hmm. Well, that fella there must be the governor. What a lovely occasion. It's always a joy to visit Stardew Valley. Okay, right, let's just have a little wander around. I'm not really sure what we're supposed to do with this event. Uh, we'll go and speak to him here. One year, Sam put a pound of anchovies in the potluck soup. Oh, pot aren't we supposed to bring food for a pot? Is that, is that what a potluck is? I've no idea. I've never. I, we don't sort of do that in the UK. So um, it's tiring to socialise with everyone. I'd rather watch the sea. I'm actually kind of with you on that one, but... Um, yeah, I think I got the socialize. So, this potluck thing. If you brought something for the soup, climb the stairs on the other side and throw it in. Yeah, see, we don't do potluck in the UK. I've, I've never heard of... I, I, I sort of heard of it, but I just kind of assumed it was like... Um, you, you bring something to the event that is then like given out as raffle prizes or something like that. Um, so, that's why I brought the, uh, the metal. Um... The, the jamborite thing. So I don't actually have any food. Did I put... Actually, did I put the snacks away? Maybe I didn't put the snacks away. I might have something I could chuck in here. Let's have a look. Uh, no. <laughs> okay, I have metal. I have precious stones. I could give you those. Uh, is there anyone that's selling something? There's normally someone selling something here. And you are... She's unresponsive. Okay. Um... Right, what else have we got? We got uh, this is, this guy over here. I can't remember what he's called now. Linus. A slow, continuous rotation is key to achieving the perfect roast. And is there anyone that's actually selling anything? We got this guy with the pirate thing. 
I'll be back here by the trees. The air is a lot cooler. I've, normally these event things, they at least have someone selling something. Hmm, maybe if I get on the governor's good side, he'll give my business a tax break. I wonder if he likes aged whiskey. There doesn't actually seem to be a lot to do here. Let's go and speak to the mayor. Look sharp, the governor's here for his annual visit. If you brought something for the potluck, make sure and add it into the soup cauldron. Uh, yeah, I, I, I didn't. Um, maybe I should have. Maybe I need to. Go, maybe I need to go and get some food. Let's. Can I leave? I can't leave. I forgot to bring stuff. People are going to be so cross with me. Uh. Okay, I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do here. Let's speak to Clint. I'm full. What else is there to do besides eat? I'm not really sure. Um. I can't actually eat anything here though. Who are you and what are you doing? Pam. Free buffet. One of the perks of living here. Enjoy it, kid. Okay, she looks a little bit crazy. Right, and yeah, I've still got nothing. Right, um... So what am I supposed to do? Abigail, give me some help. Oh, look, uh, there's... Is that the wizard down there? I really got no idea what I'm supposed to do here. Hi there, Frithgar. Taking a breather. Yeah, um, I, I kind of... Can't do anything there. Nope, nothing there. Can't go in. I can't escape and I can't go in anywhere and it's, it's horrible. Um, let me try speaking. Is she going to let me speak to her again? No, I can't speak to her again. Uh, go and speak to this guy down here. The wizard. The mer people are curious about your festivities. Right. Uh... I, I really have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. Perfect weather for a beach party, huh? And Haley, I would dance, but I don't want to get sweaty. Fair enough. Um, right, we've got the punch here. What about that guy there? Maybe he's got something that he can tell me. These blasted sandflies keep landing on the food. Okay, maybe he doesn't have anything he can tell me. I've got no way of eating anything. i got no way of getting to the food. Uh, let's speak to these two. House of Farming coming along. It must be a busy season for you. You'd have thought so, wouldn't you? It's not been all that at the moment. Not all that busy at the moment. I woke up late, stepped out of the door, and found myself in the middle of all this hubbub. And I I can't get into there either. Uh, I might go back and speak to the mayor again in a minute. There's, there doesn't seem to be any other way for me to... I can't do anything. That music, it's too loud. Can't have a little... Can't I have a little piece of quiet and enjoy the ocean? Well, you need to come down here another day to do that. Ah, the smell of the ocean takes me back many years, long before you were born. Uh, no, no, no. Right, can I do anything with this? Nope. Wow, you don't get hot pepper chutney like this in a big city. I don't really like hot pepper chutney, I've got to be honest. I must speak to the missus about purchasing a vacation home here. Should we move... Ah, here we go at last. Should we move forward with the luau? The governor seems a little hungry. Yes, let's start. Right, I don't know if I'm going to regret not bringing food. I didn't realise that that's what you were supposed to do with a potluck. I've never heard of it before. I thought it was some, something else entirely. Well, folks, it's time once again for the potluck ceremony. I trust that you all put high-quality ingredients in the pot this year. We don't want the governor to regret his visit to the valley. Uh, yeah, I did. I, I, I put in the most valuable item of food I had on me. Well, Governor, would you do us the honour of tasting the soup? Of course, I've been looking forward to this all year. Okay. Is he going to like it? Probably, because I didn't have anything to do with the cooking. <laughs> hmm. Well, it's not bad, but it's missing something. Did everyone in town contribute an ingredient to the soup? I feel like it's missing someone's unique voice. <laughs> I've let the team down here. It wouldn't let me go. I couldn't go and get stuff. Oh, dear. Oh, he's trying some as well now. You're right. It's a little bland. I should have brought some peppers. That's what I should have done. Well, thanks for joining us this year, Governor. Sorry the soup wasn't anything special. Yes, I know. Frithgar's let everybody down i've i've absolutely betrayed the whole side now who else wants some soup okay um 
The soup was bland, but the luau was still fun. And it's all my fault. It's all my fault. I was entirely responsible for the bad soup. I am sorry, citizens of Stardew Valley. I really am. I didn't mean it. I didn't know what it was. I've never done this before. It's not something we have where I'm from. I've, I've never, never heard of it before. It's potluck thing. It's, it's all new to me. I'm sorry. Will you ever forgive me? I don't know if they will. They don't. Well, fortunately, at the moment, they don't know it was me. It wasn't my. F so yeah, technically, I'm I'm kind of off the hook at the moment, but um, it things might change. I'm gonna put a torch down here so that I got some light there, and I think we also need a torch down here in the middle there. Our tree is coming along. Look at this. Can't do anything to it at the moment, but it's growing. It's growing. It will eventually get something. Right, it's 11 p.m. So let's. Oh, I will tell you what. We've actually got a couple of items in here. Now, um, I go in there. No, it's not that chest. It's in this chest here. We've got, so I've got the those two, each of those. Uh, I want to take one hot pepper and one wheat. And I'm going to sell those. I don't actually think it's worth selling these. I think what I should be doing is holding on to these and taking them to the community center because i got a load of stuff to take to the community center that i think is actually going to make us some money um but we won't worry about that for a minute i do need to get stuff over there so we've got 65 gold from there we got 25 for the wheat and 40 for the hot pepper so we we, we haven't really made a fortune here have we uh day 12 I think we should have several crops that come ripe today here on day 12. Um, but I would like to take some copper and some cash and get our pickaxe upgraded. That's the one that I'd really like to upgrade. Um, looks like a storm is approaching. Thunder and lightning is expected. That's tomorrow we've got thunder and lightning. Welcome to the weather, Oracle. Uh, the spirits feel neutral today. Right, so today I think we should do stuff out of the mine. And then tomorrow I think we should go to the mine. And we should try and get something right. We have... Oh, everything is right today. Excellent. Right, so what do we got? Uh, we've got tomatoes. Let's grab some tomatoes. And there, I'm getting quite a lot of them. I got a gold one already. And a silver one as well. Right, I got eight tomatoes. Uh, two silver ones and a gold one. I got another pepper right there. Uh, there's nothing else down here. Is that a dead one? I'm not really sure. I think it is. And I can go up through here and I can mine all of these. Oh, this is the hops, isn't it? I've got some silver ones. Three silver ones. There we go. And get all of those. Right, so we've done all of this harvesting. We've got tomatoes. We've got hops. Uh, right, we've only got silver hops. Now I'm going to I'm going to do the watering a minute. And I'm going to figure out what we need to take over to the community center. Right. We have done all of the planting that is needed to be done. I've also sorted through the chest a little bit and found what I need to take over to the thingy today. Uh, I'm not going to take these geodes over to the blacksmith at the moment because I'd like to wait until uh, the spirits are in better humor because apparently that does make a significant difference. So we're just going to go into here and I'm going to sell those tomatoes and that tomato and then these hops here. I don't think I need to keep the hops or anything. At least I'm hoping I don't. Right, so that is that done. So we should have tomorrow then a load of cash that we can take to the blacksmith and we can get our pickaxe upgraded. Now I'd like to do the pickaxe first and the axe is going to be useful to upgrade, uh, certainly back at the farm, but in the mine I think the pickaxe is going to be the better option for getting upgraded first. So we'll do that one. Ooh, though actually we could do the construction bundle quite easily if we upgrade the axe. So, I mean, we can't, we want to do both. We, we do want to get both done as sort of quickly as we possibly can. Um, what did I want to do today? Oh, I need to go to... I'm um, going up there. I need a rainbow trout. Right, I'm not even going to try that one. I am seriously considering... Right, we need to get some ammo as well. Um, I am seriously considering getting a mod in order to help me with the fishing because i'm really struggling with fishing fishing is exceptionally difficult now somebody said that these are the mayor's pants here um the back of this one but no it doesn't look like that's the mayor's pants actually so good guess good idea but it doesn't seem to be the ones that we're looking for just go there uh, to the bottom so there's no sign of the bottom how low does it go we've got to reach the bottom of the mine that's our next quest there 
Uh, we're still looking for the mayor's shorts. So we'll keep, we'll continue to keep an eye out for the shorts. And we'll see if we can spot them anywhere. I don't see them anywhere in here. So I want to go over this way. Now we've got here on this bulletin board one. Uh, we've got the chef's bundle there. I don't have anything in that one. The die bundle is the sea urchin. Now we got a silver and a gold one of these. So I'm going to take that one and put it in there. I'm also going to take the sunflower and put it in. And then we've got red cabbage, aquamarine, duck feather, and red mushroom to come later on. So we'll get those later. We've got to do 10 wheat and 10 hay. And the apple, the wheat and hay shouldn't be too much of a problem. We can go back and we can do those. Uh, those, we don't have anything yet. Um, the field research is the chub, which I brought over. So I, we did we did have a use for our chub. I'm quite pleased about that. It was seemed a bit of a shame not to be able to do anything at all with him. So that's that board there done. Then we're going to come down here into this one, and we're going to see if we can do anything down here. Um... In the Adventurer's Bundle, we don't have a Void or a Solar Essence yet, so I haven't worried about bringing the other stuff. I did bring over the Iron Bar that we got for that one. we still got the Gold Bar to do, but that one is on its way, and that'll be Minecarts Repaired when we get that one. Oh, there was another one, wasn't there? Uh, the Geologist Bundle here. I did forget to bring those, but we don't have these two here. So the Earth Crystal and the Quartz we do have, but the other two we don't yet. So we'll bring those later when we got them. And we can race back over here. I don't think we got anything for the fish tank. Um, it's over on these two over here that I've got a couple more bits. We've got some crops and a few other bits and pieces as well. So let me go into this one. Uh, don't think there was anything in the artisan bundle yet. Pomegranate. I don't know if we got a pomegranate tree or not, or if it's a different one. It might actually be a different one. Uh, summer crops bundle. That's the one that we want. We've got the um tomato and the hot pepper we need a blueberry and we need a melon i don't think i've actually got any melons at the moment we've got four crops summer crops quality crops there i need five gold star melons five pumpkins and five corn so i do need to actually get those planted i don't have any animal stuff and then i think there was one more down here just in this one here let's take a look summer foraging Yes, I've got the other two. So I do have one that I can complete. The bundle complete. There we go. Rewards bridge repair. I don't know if I, oh, no. The bridge repair is a, a bigger reward, isn't it? We get 30 summer seeds. Excellent. We've got a whole load of seeds now. That's going to really help us out, I think. And then we I think, well, we actually got another plaque being unlocked as well. That's going to be the one up there in the storage area. With a look. Yep, another one. So we'll race over there and we'll take a look and see what that one is. That little dude there is running off with that package of stuff. They're getting a lot of things accumulated in that house there. So we're coming over this way. I'm curious what this one is now. Because we've got loads of other stuff over at the vault. 2,500 gold. So we just purchased... Oh, bus repair for that one. Oh, is it bus... Oh, it's bus repair. 25,000 gold. 10,000 gold. Good gravy. Five good... Okay. Um, we won't be doing that one for a little while, I don't think. I'm not really sure what the rewards are going to be, but, um, yeah. Not, not for a minute or two, anyway. Um, right, the other thing that we wanted to do today was we actually wanted to go to the beach. Because it did say, didn't it, that there was going to be a lot of stuff available on the beach the next few days. So we want to head down there, see if we can find anything. Now, we've got 1,700 gold. I am seriously tempted to go and buy a load of seeds. Uh, and then we'll sort of get a bit of profit at the end of summer. A lot of people have been advising me that I don't need to worry too much about the community center bundles. We're not going to get them all this year, so it doesn't matter. Um, so I may as well kind of just, like, relax a little bit with them and not um, stress too much about them. What's this? Rainbow Shell. Is that one of the things that we need over in the um, in the community center? I'm sure there was a Rainbow Shell or something. I don't know. Maybe there was. Maybe there was. I'm not actually sure at the moment. Genuinely can't remember. Right, we'll head down here. We've got a muscle. We've got some more coral there as well. So we grab the oh oyster. We didn't have oyster before. And we come over onto the new bit of beach over on this side. Oh, I forgot to do the construction stuff, didn't I? Um, now that I've got more sea urchin, I've got rid of the silver one that I had. I had a nice silver sea urchin that I got rid of. I'm going to regret that, aren't I? Right, we come back up through here. There's nothing else here today. This is the only beach, isn't it? I don't think there is another beach that you can explore. Right, I'm not going to... What's that? I'm curious. Oh, I don't have a fishing rod anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Um, let's just take a look. I've got two silver. I've got a gold coral as well. Um, five normal coral, two normal sea urchins. I can't go and get the star one back. 
So we're just going to have to kind of live with that. I think these are worth a little bit of money. Let's go to, it's not this crafts room. So specialty, ocean, river fish, night fishing, lake fishing. Yeah, it's all just fish. It's not actually the corals and stuff. So I don't think that they're, oh, no, wasn't there, wasn't that, there was another one, wasn't there? Community center, it wasn't in the pantry. May have been the crafts room. We did forget to do that one. I mean, we don't have the hardwood yet anyway. Uh, for exotic, maybe it was in here? No, it wasn't in there either. So let's go through, it wasn't, it definitely wasn't in the fish tank. Boiler room, I don't think it was in the boiler room. We've got the geologist bundle there, and then you've got the standard blacksmith's bundle. No, it wasn't that one. Uh, and then we've got the vault with an absolute fortune and stuff. So fodder enchanter's bundle. No. Field research. Well, hang on, so we've got a nautilus shell there. I think a nautilus shell will probably be one of them. Chef's bundle, it wasn't in there. And then we've got the dye bundle. Oh, no, there wasn't any others. I did wonder if maybe it was one of these, like the aquamarine. I thought, but it's not. It's a rainbow shell that we got on there, so it's not the one that we're after. That's a bit of a shame. Right. So, well, it does actually mean that we can sell that stuff as well. We're going to go back, and we're going to get some of this stuff listed for sale. We've got the, well, the, we'll be keeping the spice berry. I think we're going to go back via the south road. If we head sort of east, uh, west, rather, from here... Go this way like this, and I'm just going to run along. I am actually going to check in some of these bins to see if... Right, it doesn't look like anything's coming up. I don't think we're getting anything from the bins. The reason I was looking is because I was wondering if maybe the 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 um the mayor's pants were somewhere in there. That would actually be quite good. You're just randomly rummaging through somebody else's bin and find the, the, um, the pants. The missing pants. The errant pants that he cannot find. Grab that one. Is there anything else? Anything else at all? Any more? I don't really want to go very far. I mean, I could sort of go for a big wander doing some foraging. Uh, but I don't really want to. We will just go and check this person because th this is the is a traveling trader or something. Right, we've got tulip, we've got slime, goat cheese, quality fertilizer, bait. Causes fish to bite faster. Must first be attached to a fishing rod. I don't know if we can even use that at the moment. Blood pudding, but we need a puffer fish for one of the things. Catfish, slime, poppy. They're, they're very expensive though. Rare, ooh, what's a rare seed? So in fall, takes all season to grow. I've heard about the rare seed. I've heard that the rare seed is something that you should get, but we've only got a thousand gold. I don't want to... I'm going to get it. I'm getting the rare seed, ladies and gentlemen. I've got the rare seed, but I don't know what I got to do with it. So I'm gonna—I'm not going to plant that one now. There's no way I'm planting that at the moment. I'm going to keep hold of it. Just in, you know, I'm going to find out what I need to do with it. So we may have to delay upgrading our pickaxe a little bit. It depends how much money we get from the stuff that we've got here. And what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to take the stuff that we've got and I'm going to go and put it for sale in, into the chest. Then we can worry about maybe planting a few more bits and pieces if we've got room for it here on the farm. Uh, so let's look in here. So we want to sell. Actually, I don't know what I want to sell yet. I want to go into the silver chest and I need to put a silver coral in there. Uh, no other silver stuff in here. So I'll go to the gold chest and gold, I need the coral. Uh, I don't have any other golds in there. And then the normal chest. We've got, I've already got the coral in there. I don't have a sea urchin. And, right, I want to keep one spare of those. And I'll keep two of those in there as well. That's a radish up there. Uh, the clam I want to keep. And then there was an oyster as well, wasn't there? So we grabbed that one. And a rainbow shell. It's just a very beautiful shell. It's a fish. Oh, someone lived here once. So no, the clam can come out. But the oyster is a fish, so... Actually, I think I put the fish in here, don't I? Yeah, fish stuff goes in here. And so I can put the oyster in there, the fish. And then the coral, the rainbow... Sh well, we'll keep the rainbow shell. Yeah, I'm going to put that one in here. And the sea urchin, that one's going to sell. What have we got in this side? I don't have any more clams. Uh, okay, I'm going to keep the clam. Just because. Right, let's go here. And we want to sell... A sweet pea, a sea urchin, a silver star coral, five ordinary coral, and that'll do. Okay. Now we can go over this side and... Oh, what about fertilizer? Have I got fertilizer? I suppose I should concern... I should try to do something with the fertilizer. It's only 6 p.m. We've got time. We do have time to do this, ladies and gentlemen. Let's have a look in here. I want to take that one. 
And I have no fertilizer. I'm going to take the sap and I can make a load of fertilizer if I go into crafting. Basic retaining soil. That takes stones, doesn't it? And then basic fertilizer. Have I got an upgrade? Oh, speed grow. Pine tar and a clam. Well, I don't have that. I can make cherry bombs. We might try that at some point. So wild seeds there is spice, berry, grape, and sweet pea, which is basically what we've got here, the summer seeds. Uh, right, let's go for basic fertilizer then. I'm going to go for 20. Actually, I'm going to go two more. If I go for 30 of those, it's the same number that I've got uh, as the seeds. And we'll see if we can actually get a load of these planted. So I'm going to go to the sword here and just chop a bit of this back. I might have to do some more building. We may do... Well, I'm not going to have time in this episode. We, we, we have run out of time in this episode. So we're just going to do a little bit of planting and then that is going to be it. I'm just going to dig that one up and that one as well. And then I'm going to start doing some hoeing. I'm going to go to that one. I think that there, I think, is a dead plant, actually. I've got a feeling that I have a dead plant on my hands. So let's dig through there. I'm going to dig a patch three down. There we go. Over like that. And dig behind me as well. And into the next bit. There we go. There. And one there. Right. And then I can take the torch and I can put one torch down there and I'm going to put another torch down there in the south. And then we're going to go to the speed grow, the fertilizer, and we're going to start plonking that down there like that. And there. There we go. So we've got nine more, which will make a full 30. Uh, three to go. I don't think I can plant in that area there. So I'm just going to dig up the... I'm going to dig two more over here. One there and one there. And then I'm going to go back over to the fertilizer. And I'm going to go one, two, and three. Right, that's all of those. So now we'll get these plants down. And then i got to water them all. That's going to be the, another time-consuming bit. So run over like that and plant as fast as we possibly can. Because night is going to be falling soon. And then we come back up through there like that. Right, so they're all done. And then I can go to the watering can. And just start watering all of these like this. And I'm just going to go and get one there. And then if I come along the top here and look down, I'll be able to get all of them in a line as I go through like that. And then I'll come down underneath and grab the last one. And it'll be job done. So it'll be interesting to see what we have tomorrow. Because I've got a couple of spaces here that are now already grown. Um, I've got that one there that doesn't have anything in it. And then we had... With some of these are like grown, so I don't know if we get more plants from them later, like the tomatoes and that or not, and the, also the, the peppers. I've got no idea on those. But anyway, that is all of that. I'm going to grab this one up here, and I'll put in some more. There we go, put that in there. And that's all i got time for. So if you enjoyed the episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And we will just go to sleep for the night and we'll see what money we get. Level 5, foraging, choose a profession. Wood is worth 50% more. Chance for double harvest of foraged items. Ooh. I have no idea which one I want. I genuinely don't. Right, you double harvest on foraged items. That's only on foraged items. I'm thinking that for Forester might actually be... Because that would be two gold per piece of wood, but then hardwood... Uh, yeah, but is that worth it? I don't know! I really don't know! I'm going to regret whichever choice I make, aren't I? I'm genuinely going to regret this. I'm going for Gatherer. I'm going for Gatherer. I've done it. I've committed. Ooh, look at the money! 1,300 gold. So we got uh, the six tomatoes of 360 gold. 75 for that one. Two hops of 62. Another 150 gold for those six. And then we come in here and we got 100 gold from a silver star there. 400 gold from those five. The sea urchin alone is 160 gold crumbs. It's insane. Okay, shells are worth a lot of money. We, we, we want to be getting some more shells. That is fantastic. That is absolutely super. And we got the money. Right. You can hear it outside. It's raining, so we don't need to worry about watering today. Uh, but we're going to be doing that in the next episode. We're going to go and we're going to go and get our pickaxe upgraded today. Oh, in our next episode, that's going to be the first thing that we do. And we can let him do that. And then we're going to have to wait a little while while that gets done. So no trips to the mines while that's happening. But anyway, 
Um, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye, and see you later.